Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how I made this prayer mat. Alternatively, using the same method, you can also make a rug or a beach blanket or even a picnic blanket. If you like this, keep watching. Okay, so you will need some fabric. I'm going to be using this bath towel that I bought from Primark. To decorate my mat, I'm going to be using some ribbon and some beading. I bought all this stuff from my local market, but you should be able to find these in any craft store. A roll of anti-slip rug gripper, which is also self-adhesive. Some fabric glue and fabric scissor. Okay, so you need to measure out your fabric so what you need to do is place it on a flat surface and then place your prayer mat on top of it okay so my bath towel was slightly bigger than my prayer mat so I'm not going to trim this down okay so if you're using a fabric and you have trimmed it down what I would recommend you do is fold it over one centimeter and sew it all the way around this will stop it from fraying now ready to decorate so I'm going to take the ribbon and then sew it all the way around. I'm going to sew the ribbon as closely as possible to the edge. I'm also going to be leaving an inch of ribbon before I start sewing. Okay so when you get to the end make sure that you keep another inch before you cut the ribbon. Okay, so now you're ready to sew the inside edge of the ribbon. Okay, so the corners of your mat should look like this. Okay, so now turn over your fabric and then we're just going to use the mat grip to hide any raw edges. The mat grip that I'm using is already self-adhesive so all I need to do is just tape it onto the back of my fabric. Also I'm going to be using this on both lengths of the fabric and not all the way around. Before I move on to the next step I need to tell you that I'm not going to be decorating the end of my fabric. This will just make it easier for me to know where I need to be standing on my mat while I'm praying. But if you're making a rug for your room, um, I would definitely recommend that you do all four edges. Okay, now taking the fabric glue, just place a little bit of glue all around the edge of the fabric and then I'm going to be placing my beading on here. I would definitely recommend that you only do a couple of inch at a time, this will make it easier for you. This glue dries transparent so I would definitely recommend that you use the glue as generously as possible. If you use uh, the fabric glue then I would definitely recommend that you let the glue dry for 24 hours before using your prayer mat. And that's it, you're done. I hope you guys enjoyed my tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe, like and share. You can also find me on Instagram, Facebook and Twitter. Also, if you decide to make a prayer mat, do show me on Instagram. I would love to see. So hashtag bubblegum hijab. Until next time, bye bye.